What's up friends, how you are doing today? Today we bring you a video on your Bluetooth controller and for man for joy I'm going to show you how to program the controller and also some of you guys have been pro having problems with uh, once you turn off the system or you, you close the app you uh, then when you want to play again you actually lose um, the program so you actually have to uh, reprogram the controller back to the man for joy and that's a big hassle so I'm going to show you uh, how to do it permanently and that way you can keep it on your on your phone and your man for joy and also whenever you turn it on it will always have that um, program buttons that you like okay so let's go ahead and start we're gonna go ahead and start with uh, programming the the Bluetooth to the controller we're gonna pair it it's gonna be on pair mode so that's already on pair mode so I'm just gonna go um, I already have it as game gamepad so it's just connecting let's just wait Okay, it's already paired okay so from here we're gonna go into um, the man for droid app I'm gonna have my game launcher this is my game um, man for droid and from here we're gonna go into we're gonna program first the, the controller to the man for droid application and for that we're gonna go into options I'm gonna go into settings I'm sorry we're gonna go into input we're gonna go into external controllers and from here we're gonna go to the first one that says mode okay and usually if you haven't done this before you're gonna have the second option the one that says control auto detection so whenever you connect it you already have some pre program buttons here on the system and it should work automatically but since we're gonna program the controller to the man for droid we need the first option which is general multi-controller all right after that we're gonna go into define keys and then from here we're gonna go into player one and here we're gonna program the controller to okay so for up just press up and you get this menu that means that it's, um, it's okay to program the controller now so press up on your controller down down left left right right uh, we're gonna go a that will be our light light punch B will be our medium punch C will be our heavy punch D will be our light kick E is our, our medium kick F will be our heavy kick okay and I'll go ahead and uh, put uh, like a little picture on the uh, on the screen telling you how they go okay then we have coin and I'll put them on select start I'll put it on start exit I'll go ahead and use this one as exit okay an option well that one will leave it again so here we're just gonna go into back 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 and it's already programmed so now to do it permanently we have to go into the game menus so let's say um, we're gonna do it with uh, Street Fighter so we'll do it with Street Fighter so when, once you're here on the main menu we'll just wait once you're here on the insert coin screen you're gonna press coin and then start okay then you're gonna get this menu so on the first one you input general go ahead and press B then from here we're gonna set up the coin and uh, and uh, start okay so we're gonna go all the way to uh, other controls and then we're gonna go into the first one the one that says player start and on here again you're gonna press B on your on your phone and that will be program mode start so we're gonna go and press start okay then we're gonna go down all the way to where it says coin coin one and again we're gonna press B to to be on program mode 
get the two arrows and then press select as our coin okay so just go up all the way up you're gonna go to return to prior menu and then we're gonna go here to the fan part okay so we're gonna go up to player one controller okay so here we have all the um, we have the up down down left right so we're gonna go ahead and program those again so they can be to the to the games that you actually have on your phone okay so we're gonna go into it and on the first one the one that says P1 up you're gonna press B again program mode on your phone you get the two arrows then press up then you're gonna go down on your phone then you're gonna press the B in program mode then you press uh, down on your controller okay and then you go down left you're gonna press B you're gonna go to the left and then you go down press B and it's gonna go to your right on your controller okay and just a uh, FYI in case you do um, mess up let's say you press the B and then by accident you press like X then you get that so it's not gonna work so in order for you to erase it or just go back to how it was just gonna press B again on your phone and on your phone you're gonna press exit and then it's gonna go to none okay so for that you just go ahead and press B again to program it then you have the right so press right and there you go okay so now we're gonna go into the buttons okay so from here you have button one button one two and three will be your light medium and then your heavy punch the three four five and six will be your light kick medium kick and then the six will be your heavy kick okay so I'm gonna go ahead and program this controller to how we have it like on Street Fighter you have medium punch I'm sorry we have light punch medium punch then we have heavy punch over here okay and then you have um, you have a will be your light kick medium kick and then your roundhouse heavy kick okay So, and then I'll show you how I do want it and how to program it here on your phone, okay? So again, uh, just uh, FYI again, in case you do mess up for one of the buttons, so you're gonna press, once you press B and it's on your program mode on your phone, you're gonna go ahead and, uh, let's say you want, you press Y and you, and you don't want the light punch here on the Y. So all you have to do is just press B you're gonna press exit on your phone okay and then just, that's gonna turn into none okay so all you have to do to program it again you're gonna press B again and then you go ahead and um, select the button that you want so for button one it's already on program mode we're gonna choose X and that's where I want my my light punch and then we're gonna go into button two you're gonna press B and I want it here on our Y. And then we're gonna go on button three. And then press B to program. Then I want the button three heavy punch over here on the on the top. Okay, button four. We're gonna go into our A. Okay, and button five, which it's the medium kick. We're gonna press B on your phone and it's gonna be the medium kick over here okay go down on your phone and then we're gonna look into uh, button six and that would actually be the wrong house so it's over here so and that's it guys it's that easy so let's go ahead and uh, just return to prior menu and also prior menu.
return to game and let's go ahead and test it out okay so let me put some coins and start and we're gonna use another another guy there we go this is the light punch this is the medium and this is the heavy as you can see if you go down you do the uppercut okay then we have our light kick our medium kick then our roundhouse as you can see there okay and that's how you program it so um, in order for us to go ahead and um, program it how you want the buttons so all you have to do is this you're gonna go to coin press coin and start and then you're gonna go to the first one again input general and then you go down you're gonna go to player one controls okay so now you're gonna go down and you're gonna go down here to P1 button. I'm gonna leave that one uh, good. I like the light button here. But I want my heavy punch and my heavy kick over here and the mediums over here. So um, in order to do that, we're gonna go into button two, which is the medium punch. So, but here I want the heavy, the heavy um, punch. So what I'm gonna do, just gonna go ahead and program this B. And then we're gonna go into since this is the the, the fierce punch, I'm gonna go ahead and press it. That way I can I just switch this one to here, and we're gonna switch the Y to over here, which is the medium. So now you're gonna go down to button three. You're gonna press it, press B, and then you're gonna press the Y okay because you you want this medium punch on on the third button okay so that's how it's gonna look and that's it guys so that's how you do it so let's go ahead and do the the kicks now so we're gonna go into um, button five button five remember we had medium kick here we have the roundhouse so I want the roundhouse here and the medium kick on top so we're gonna go into button five. We're gonna press B to program it. And since I want the, the roundhouse here, I'm gonna press over here the roundhouse. Okay, and it's already here in our button five. Okay, so we're gonna go into button six. I'm gonna press B to program it. And then we're gonna press um, the B button so you can go to this button okay so you press B and now let's go ahead and try it out it's already set so we're gonna go back exit 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 so we're gonna go ahead and test it out so we had placed the fierce button here and the fierce kick here so we have the light punch we have the light kick and this is the fierce punch Okay. And we have the roundhouse. And we have the medium kick, medium punch. And that's it, guys. That's how you program the buttons to your Man for Droid. And let's go ahead and try it out. I'm going to go ahead and exit. I'm going to close it completely. And then we're going to go ahead and try it and see if it stays, okay? Because some of you guys say that you always, when you close it, you have to reprogram everything again so let's go ahead and try it so we're gonna exit okay exit then I'm just gonna go ahead and close the this is the man for joint this one and I'm gonna close also the game launcher let me go and close everything okay so I'm gonna go into my game launcher I'm gonna have my man for joint then again, we're going to go into Street Fighter. Okay, 
you're gonna press start. Okay, should have tried it over here, right? Okay, so let's go ahead and move. And then we have like punch, fierce punch, like kick, roundhouse. Okay, then we have the medium kick and the medium punch. All right, friends, so that's how you program your Bluetooth controller to your Manford Droid, and that way you don't have to worry about uh, reprogram the phone every time you go into that to the app. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, please let me know. I will leave everything on the notes below. Uh, please comment, please like, share, and subscribe. Um, again, guys, thank you for, we're almost at 3,000 subscribers. Um, hopefully we get it done um, this year and i want to wish everybody a happy new year stay safe and well guys thank you and we'll see you on the next one peace out